Hey guys, I'm Greg. And I'm Ashley. And this is the Living and Learning Podcast. On this podcast, we speak with fascinating guests to uncover how they've experienced life change by crossing cultures, crossing borders, and expanding their worldview. So let's dive in. All right. So as we are talking about discipleship, I'd love to hear a little bit more about one-on-ones within our program. Uh, We have a session on resident coordinator and discipleship, but I love to dissect a little bit more about what does a one-on-one look like? Is it I'm just sitting in front of my RC, like hoping that I can come up with (laughs) things to talk about? What does it actually look like? Yeah, that's a great question. Um, It looks different for every RC and every student, honestly. And we are so flexible with what that looks like because not every student is comfortable sitting across the table and just staring at their RC. Yeah. Um, And so it can look like getting your nails done. It could look like shooting hoops, going on a walk. It could look like sitting at a table and getting coffee or cake or whatever it is that you want. But it is meant to be intentional and it is meant to be comfortable for the students so that they feel like they can open up in that space and not feel so pressured. Yeah. So whatever that atmosphere looks like for them is what we tend to do. Um, A lot of times it is walking side by side or painting or something like that because that is more comfortable for students. But yeah, we're just really open to what that looks like for them. How do you actually figure out what works for the student? What does that look like? Yeah, I think that is offering them different ideas and kind of seeing what fits for them um, and then trying out different things. And so one week it could be painting, the next it could be walking, the next it could be um, getting food together. And so it's just kind of seeing what feels most comfortable for them. But usually it's them starting with hearing their options and then choosing from there. Yeah. I remember when I was at RC a long, long time ago, uh, one of my students wanted to go get our hair done together so that was one fun thing That's I did amazing. never dyed my hair before <laughs> in my life so it was my first time and I just did one little strip in my hair it was awesome <laughs> That's incredible. but yeah I feel like that is one thing that is really awesome is we try to uh, just relate with the student of their yes. personality and what um, would actually make them feel comfortable so yeah it's great to hear about a little more about what one-on-ones look like thanks thanks